Hey there guys, this is Zach from SJP and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to root your brand new Galaxy Note 3. Let's get started. So guys, down below I will include a link to a website that has all the downloads you're going to need to install. There's four different downloads right here and so the most important one is going to be the recovery. So that's the very top one. If we open that up, right now there are only the international models supported but I'm sure in a couple of weeks there will be the other carriers as AT&T and T-Mobile, Ryzen and Sprint. So just make sure to install all four of these links and once you've done that we're going to go back to your phone. Okay so once you've downloaded those four files what we're going to want to do is we're going to power off our Note 3. So hold the power button and click power off and this will shut down your device. So next what we want to do is we want to hold the volume down, power button, and our home button. So click them all together at the same time and we'll enter this download mode. Next what you want to do is click volume up to continue. So once you've done that, what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to connect it to our USB cable. So I'm going to connect it and then we're going to go back to the computer. Okay, so go into the files of your computer and we're going to want to see something that says Odin V185. That should show up after you have unzipped the file and we're going to click on the program right here. So if you installed the drivers link and ran it on your computer, then you will see a yellow number on the corner. Otherwise, we're not going to click anything except PDA. Click on PDA and then you should see your recovery. So I do have the N900, so I'm going to select the recovery that I installed. And after that, that's all. So PDA and that's it. What you're going to do is you're going to click start. I have already done this and I don't need to do it again. But what it's going to take about two seconds. It's going to say reset and pass. So just let it do its thing. Your phone is then going to reboot. So once your device is rebooted, leave it plugged in and we're going to go into our files and scroll down to the update super SU file that we downloaded. So let me scroll down here and as you can see there it is. So we're going to copy that and then we're going to go back to our phone and paste it anywhere you want. So just paste it somewhere. I already have it pasted. Just click copy paste and then it will be there. After that you can unplug your device. So once you've done all that, there's going to be one last step that you have to do to get root access. So what we're going to want to do is we're going to power off our device. So hold the power button, power off your Note 3. And then we're going to hold power button, home button, and power up. And this is going to be the manual way to get into recovery. Of course, later we can install apps that help us get into recovery a lot easier. So hold on to those three buttons and I'll tell you when to let go. So just keep holding. Give it a little time. So there was a little flash at the top and it should take us into recovery. So there we are. We're now in re custom recovery. And what we want to do is the volume rockers are what you use to go up and down. And your power button is what you use to select. So we want to go down to install zip. And then install zip from SD card and go all the way down to where your file is. So there it is, update super SU 1.65. We're gonna click the power button and then you're gonna go down and click install. So I've already done that. All you do is click install and it'll quickly install it. Once you've done that, we're gonna go back and just keep going back to get back to the main menu and now you will click reboot system now and you probably won't get asked this just ignore it that didn't happen to me when I first rooted it so once you've done that that's gonna be pretty much it it's gonna reboot 
it's gonna have to update the app so give it a little bit of time and once it's done that you have a rooted note 3 go on and install anything you want congratulations I hope this video helped you guys out and it's a very easy and quick way to root your new note 3 Guys, please give this video a thumbs up and also do make sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching.